Can one think that because we are engineers, beauty does not preoccupy us or that we do not try to build beautiful, as well as solid and long-lasting structures? Aren't the genuine functions of strength always in keeping with unwritten conditions of harmony? Besides, there is an attraction, a special charm in the colossal to which ordinary theories of art do not apply. There is an attraction and a charm inherent in the colossal that is not subject to ordinary theories of art. The tower will be the tallest edifice ever raised by man. Will it therefore be imposing in its own way? The French flag is the only one to have a staff a thousand feet tall. The first principle of architectural beauty is that the essential lines of a construction be determined by a perfect appropriateness to its use. Ah, well I claim that the curves of the four arts of the monument, as the calculations are given to them, will give a great impression of strength and beauty. Well, I think the curves of the four pillars of the monument, as calculations have given them, give a sense of strength, and extraordinary beauty. It seems to me that it had no other rationale than to show that we are not simply the country of entertainers, but also that of engineers and builders called from across the world to build bridges viaducts, stations and major monuments of modern industry, the Eiffel Tower deserves to be treated with consideration. Quotes from Gustav Eiffel, whose full name is Alexander Gustav Eiffel, December 15, 1832.